Relationship is an investment. Relationship is an investment. There is no investment on earth higher or greater or superior than relationship. A man that knows what relationship is all about will spend all his years on earth in favor, in miracles, in blessings through relationship. Remember that relationship is the highest connection on earth. Anytime you look for you look at your right hand side or your left hand side, front and back, you see someone there, you will know that you are insufficient of your own. You need the help of another person by your side. Stop abusing relationship. There are many people that abuse relationship 24 hours. They are abusing relationship. Please show me love to subscribe to my YouTube channel or and click to follow button if you are watching me from Facebook, please. And also share this message to many people. Forward this message to your contacts so that people will hear it and we join hands together to save life. God bless you. Learn how to manage relationship. Learn how to manage relationship. Relationship is an investment. All the prayers we are praying on earth, I can say that 90 to 95 percent of prayers and fasting we are engaging on earth is something that the relationship can deliver to us. All the prayers we are praying, we are simply asking God, send the man to me, send the woman to me. Whenever you pray, you simply tell God, send a man to me, send a woman to me. That is the meaning of our prayers. Oh Lord, I am asking for a car. Lord, give me a car in Jesus' name. You are just telling God, oh Lord, send a man or a woman that you will use. The 90 to 95 percent of our prayer and our fasting is what relationship can do for us. Manage relationship very well. There are many people God sent on your way many years ago. There are a lot of people God sent to you many years ago, but you did not understand how to manage relationship. You 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 abuse it. You 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 make your relationship that relationship will break on the way. And the most of the people God connected you to many years ago, many of them today, some are now governors, some are now uh, a house of a house of assembly member, some are now president, some are now head of state, some are now in one higher position or the other. The CEOs of different companies, but because you abuse that relationship, you abuse the relationship. That is why you do not get anything in return at the end. Learn how to manage relationship. Learn how to manage relationship. And they also, if everything you have, whether you are poor or you are rich, Learn how to manage relationship. You that are watching this message, you may be a wealthy person today. You need a poor person. That poor man, that poor woman is very important to you. If you are a poor man or poor woman watching this message, you need a wealthy person. is very, very important to you. Don't say because you are wealthy, you don't need poor people. No. If all you have in life is money, you are poor. If everything you have in life ended up in money, you are a poor man, you are a poor woman. If the only thing you have in life is a house and have millions and billions in your account, you are poor. You need relationship in every area of life. David went to palace through relationship because Jonathan, son of Saul, loved David. They were close friends. I remember that day Jonathan said to David, you will be king first and after you, I will be the king. Learn how to manage relationship is very, very important. It's very, very important. If you did not manage relationship very well, 
you will be surprised the kind of things, the kind of result you will be having in your life. And many times, what we are blaming Satan, what we are blaming demons and darkness is not, it is just abusing of relationship. Manage your relationship very well. You see that poor man, you see that poor brother, you see that poor sister, that poor woman, God connected you to today. Manage that relationship very well because you don't know why God connects that brother to you. You don't know why God connects that sister to you. You don't know whether that person today will become your ladder tomorrow. And that is why I'm saying this word to you. If you are a worthy man, you are a worthy woman, worthy sister, worthy brother, never you will than play or than great poor people around you. Never. Because you don't know what they will become tomorrow. You don't know the area you will need your help tomorrow. Never. And the, the only thing you will do is to find what you can do for them based on your level. Maybe when people, poor people come to you, poor man come to you, poor brothers come to you, hungry people come to you looking for money from you, looking for blessing from you, looking for material things from you. If you have anything to offer to them, offer them, but never you abuse them because you don't know what they will become in future. And I am talking to you right now. If you can manage this relationship, if you can handle relationship very well, it will take you to a higher level. It will take you to a higher level. Remember that some relationship will not give you money. Some relationship will not give you money. So you will understand there are some people God will connect to you not to give you money. Some people God will connect to you is to not give you material things. They are not there for material things. They are not there for money, to supply your money. There are some people God will connect you to the idea for material things, to, for them, for God to use them to give you money, give you favor. But not every relationship will bring those things. There are some people God will send to you in order to correct you when you are going astray. You need that kind of relationship. There are some people God will connect you to, they will be covering the spiritual side of you. They will be helping you in the realm of the spirit. Manage that relationship very well. There are some people God will connect you to. They are the one God will be using them. God will be giving you money through them. God will be giving you help through them. But not every relationship provides money to you. Not every relationship offers you material things. Not every relationship offers you things you can see. There are some relationships that give you advice. Some relationships that will help you. That will help you talk to you. Help you in the area of your destiny. Don't say because this relationship is not offering me money. You break it. You will miss along the way. Don't say because this relationship is, a, is not offering me material things. You quit from that relationship. No. Learn how to manage relationship. And I pray for you today that any area you have made mistake that devil used to afflict your soul today. In the name of Jesus, I stretch forth my hands. May the Lord show you mercy in Jesus' name. May the favor of God speak over your life. May the glory of God shine upon you. May the miracle of God rest upon you in the name of Jesus. Everyone under the sound of my voice, you will never miss your reward. In the name of Jesus Christ. Don't forget to show me that love by subscribing to my YouTube channel and follow me on my Facebook page at Anthony Ministry TV. God bless you. May the peace of God and the God of peace be with you. See you next time. And bye for now.